Yo Prestige fam, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe and turn on notifications. Also I'm giving away free Fortnite V-Bucks, GTA 5 shark cards and Apex coins only for you guys. To be a part of it, make sure you're subscribed with notifications on, drop a like on the video and leave a comment on what you want to win or anything else about the video. Winners are announced bi-weekly on Sundays, enjoy the video. Deuces! Hey everyone, and welcome back to this brand new video uploading here on the channel of Game Time Life. Now in this video, I'm going to be showing you a brand new glitch that basically I think has been out for some time, but the method to like finally do it has been released, and in this video I'm going to show you the full tutorial how to get the rare colored bulletproof helmets off the latest patch of 1.46. Now with this method you can get all the colors, I will leave them all in the description box down below with the components behind it, I will also tell you in this video, but yeah, I will tell you them all. So basically you can get the white, the blue, the tan, the red, the grey, all the colors, you can get it through this really easy method. Now I'm going to show or I'm going to tell you the things that you must need in order to do this glitch. So. First of all, you need to have two consoles or you need to have a friend who has access to your account on their PlayStation. So that means you have to trust the person uh, with your account. But that is a thing that you must need, either a friend who can log into your account on a new system or you need to have two PlayStations for. Now I'm quickly going to show you the helmet components right now. So first of all we have the Ace of Spades Dome Helmet. This one will give you the white bulletproof helmet if you put this one on. I will be using the white bulletproof helmet in this video for my white joggers. Next we have the right free dome. This one will be the 10 bulletproof helmet. Then we have the Ox and Hatchet Dome. This one will be the grey bulletproof helmet. Next up we have the Feathers Dome, this one will be the blue bulletproof helmet. Then we have the Green Dome, which will be the red bulletproof helmet. Then we have the Stars and Stripes Dome, this one will be the pink one. Then we have the Orange Fiber, which will be the purple one. And then we're gonna scroll down to the Carbon Spikes, it will be the green one. And then we have the Black Dome, and that one will be the orange helmet. So those are all the helmet components, like I said they will also be in the description. So you need to like put yourself on any outfit and just apply the helmet components with the color that you want to get. So like I said I'm going for the white one. So you want to make sure that you save it anywhere, I just saved it all the way at the bottom. And then also a thing that you must need is a adversary mode colored helmet. So I got myself this adversary outfit from drop zone so just make sure you grab one of these outfits from drop zone so you need to already have one of these uh, plain colored bulletproof helmets save it so it doesn't matter which one green orange purple or pink make sure you have one of these outfits save it the link to save adversary mode outfits will be in the description box down below all right so this will be playstation number one this is your main account this is your playstation and this is where you're working on so what you have to do is once you have picked the helmet and you have saved the outfit, make sure that you keep it on your character. Now if you have your outfit with the uh, green, orange, purple, pink helmet save it, you have this outfit save it, then you can start with the glitch. So you want to put on a pair of glasses and then you should see the yellow save icon in the bottom right corner. Make sure that your game saves, so that means that the yellow save icon um, it's loading and then once it disappears then it means it's saved. It. So I had some issues here I will skip this part a bit But make sure that uh, you've had the yellow save icon As soon as you've seen the yellow save icon you want to hold down on the d-pad and you want to switch over To any story mode character and simply make your way inside of story mode Now once we are here inside story mode you want to wait until the scenes are over and just let your PlayStation like rest Alright, so now we're going to be switching over to our second PlayStation. Um, you can just simply tell your friend to log into your account now, or just go on your second console and just log in on the same account by yourself. So once your friend or you are logged into your second account, 
Then you should uh, load up GTA 5 and you will spawn in with Franklin or any story mode character. All you have to do on the second console is press pause, go to the online tab and make your way over to choose character. Now on the choose character screen you should see your character wearing that dome helmet and a pair of glasses. You do not want to do anything, all you have to do is just leave PlayStation 2 or tell your friend to just simply wait here on the screen on his or her PlayStation. So just leave your character here on the choose character screen and now you want to switch back over to PlayStation number 1 or just go back to your own console. Now if you switch back to your own console you should get a blue screen like somebody else join it or, or log it into your account just hit ok on that log back into the account click back on GTA and you should be back here in story mode. Now on PlayStation number one if you're back in story mode open up the pause menu and simply make your way over to a GTA 5 invite only session. Now if you spawn in and you get the error message just simply accept it and if you are back in story mode make your way back to a invite only session. That may happen a lot during this glitch ever if you ever get like the message accept it and return back to an online session. Alright so I'm back here in an online session with the male character and now from this point you want to open up the interaction menu go to style accessories and just simply apply your uh, helmet outfit so for me I'm going to be putting on the green helmet outfit right there now if you got your adversary mode helmet outfit on just put on a pair of glasses and just make sure you see the yellow save icon in the bottom right corner again as soon as you see that this yellow save icon disappeared then it means it's save it all you have to do from this point is again hold down on the d-pad and switch back over to any story mode character and accept the alert and just wait until you load back into story mode. Now as soon as you are back here in story mode then you can just leave console number one as it is right there. Wait for the cutscene to go away and now you want to go back over to PlayStation number two or just tell your friend to do the following step. So on PlayStation number two your friend also has like the blue screen make sure that he hits ok logs back into your account and just simply goes back to GTA and if everything is correctly then you should see that on PlayStation number two you are still on this character selection screen so what you want to do is simply hit X on the character and just take it inside of a online session and you should see that your character is still wearing that dome helmet together with the pair of glasses so now your character will just simply load in an online session so I'm going to fasten this part a little bit so as soon as you are back here in an online session these will be like one of the last steps to do you're almost there and you're almost done with the glitch so if you have spawned it in here then all you have to do is open up the interaction menu make your way over to inventory go over to ammo and just buy yourself full ammo for like any weapon so as soon as you've bought the full ammo for any weapon you want to back out you want to go to style go to accessories and it's very important that you take off the glasses right now so now you should only be wearing your dome helmet now as soon um, as your friends like basically did all these steps then you're good to go if you have seen the yellow save icon in the bottom right corner then you can now again hold down on the d-pad and just switch back over to any story mode character and hit ok now from this point your friend is basically done um, all he has to do is just simply wait inside story mode until you are, are back in an on online session after this step so he doesn't have to do anything anymore if he did all these steps or if you've done all these steps on your second console then you're good to go so as soon as you your friend or you is are back here in story mode wait for the cutscenes to go away like I always tell you and now you can switch back over to your primary PS4 or like your own PS4 now on your own PS4 you can open up the pause menu again and just simply make your way over to an invite only session and like I said before if you get the error message simply accept it and then make your way back into an invite only session so as soon as you are back here in an online session you should see yourself the colored helmet that you want boom it's there and as you can see my joggers also turn it white I've been testing with this method to like see if you can get all the pairs of colored joggers but it was because my main outfit with like the helmet also had white joggers so it's not really like a glitch to get all the colored joggers which is a shame 
You can only get like the green or the orange default joggers from this method. All right, so I have the helmet right there. I'm just simply going to be saving it on any slot. And now you can just simply transfer it over to any of your outfits that you want using the car glitch. So your outfit will not be removed, this helmet will stick, it is transferable to different outfits and everything. So yeah, you're good to go. Now you can just simply do it again. Um, if you want to get the other, other colored helmets, then just apply your components again. And just tell your friend to like log into your account and just simply close the GTA 5 game that he was logged in with your account. And then just log back out of your account and then you can just start over again or else the glitch won't work. So make sure that your friend just closes the app before you start it again. Okay, so this was basically the video on how to get these rare colored bulletproof helmets. In the meantime, I got them all on my account, so I'm very happy. I hope you guys like this glitch as much as I do, especially because it doesn't delete outfits and you will keep all your stuff. Subscribe if it worked for you. Turn on post notifications to get informed with the latest videos and uploads here on the channel. And I hope to see you back in the next video. Bye everyone! Yo, what's good Prestige community? It's Zav or PMHD here. Don't forget to check out the director featured in today's video if you enjoyed it. Sub link is at the top of the description. Check out our previous videos too. Subscribe, stay tuned, stay prestige. Peace.